Hello folks, Jason Cressman here of JC's Bees. This morning it's 19 degrees. It's nice and cold. So the honeybees ought to be in the state of torpor. And I wanted to show you a pretty neat experiment. Okay, the first order of business here is we got to find a couple bees to use for this experiment. And I want to find a couple that's out away from the cluster. So before we go in, let's take a close look at these bees. Um, you can see they're, they're definitely not moving. Um, as I roll them around in my hand, you can see there is no response. They are what seems to be completely lifeless. But let me show you a little something. Okay, so I'm back in the house now where it's nice and warm and I wanted to show you something. Um, a lot of people think in the winter when they check on their bees, um, just because they do not see motion, that the bees are dead. That's not the case. Um, if the temperature gets cold enough, the bees will drop into something called torpor, which is a hibernative stage. When they're in this stage, they give the uh, appearance that they are dead, lifeless. So what I wanted to show you today is I brought these two bees that appear to be lifeless inside the house where it's nice and warm. Outside it's about 19 degrees and in here we're preaching about 70, 73 degrees. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to take my hands and I'm going to cup them around these bees and I'm just going to blow some warm air on them. It's already taken effect, folks. I want to try and hold this to where you can see what's going on here. You see her starting to move around, don't you? She's not dead. I'm going to continue to blow warm air over top of her as I record. As you can see, she's waking up. She is definitely not dead. Look, the other bee, it's coming to life. Just by me blowing warm air across her. Gives the idea that it's warming up. I do not need to be in torpor anymore. Torpor is just a way of slowing down uh, the metabolism, so they do not use as much resources. Um, there's warm periods, the bees will eat a lot. And during the cold, cold periods, they'll go in torpor and eat very little. They're definitely not dead bees. So, my suggestion to you if you think you've got a dead bee colony, wait till a nice warm day before you decide to clean the hive out. Don't touch it, they could still be alive. Looks like the second bee is still not quite all the way awake, but it did move. We all seen that. So I hope this video has helped explain how torpor works. If you haven't subscribed, please take time to do so. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below. And thanks for watching, folks. JC's Bees.